We're back. Are you on a bus stranded somewhere in the middle of nowhere near Spokane area? I've got the answer. Four square water bottles. Good water. Mm. So awesome you might drink holy water. Purchase for $10.99. No refunds. <laughs> Buy now, get one. Buy one, get one free if you call now. Like we have that much. Ugh. That's the front of the bus. Tyler? Are you kidding me? Take it off. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's the auto. You go, you go to the USA. You know where the bed is? I'm so bored right now. Whoa. How is this? What the? It zoomed in by accident. So bored. I'm videotaping. Dylan. Hey man. Dylan, next time you're dating, you should be like. We've broken down two times. It's just really hot in here right now. Story time, Elijah. What? Story time. Story time. That time. Okay, yeah. Time. We were on the bus. It was really hot. And it broke down twice, but it also picked up twice. My turn. And, and then, and then, and then, I'm not done. And then Elijah met this girl on the side of the road, and then like 40 years later. Oh yeah, I met this girl on the side of the road, and we got married, but she like never talked to me. And uh, then I realized it's because she was on the side of the road. She was she a mime. Was dead. She was a mime. She'd been hit by a car. And she was a dead, dead mime. No, she was just dead. She was just dead on the side of the road, but I married her. Because she, she was that desperate, isn't it? Like no one had ever loved me before. Yeah, she just kept staring at him. It's so weird. Roadkill. A real story. Three times she broke down. Little did we know. Uh, Native Indians came to save us each time. Uh, they live in the windmills. They're the ones that uh, spin them. They create the energy. Uh, they came around the bus and they chanted wait, wait, many wait, times. Wait, 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 No, dude, 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 you don't know. The, the, the Indians chanted around the bus, Kumbaya, many times. And uh, it started many times. And then they just kept on running after us with their sled dogs. As you can see, we are in the snow. And uh, the, the sled dogs helped us also. They ended up pulling the bus. You the dirty laundry fairy. Oh, uh, the dirty laundry fairy? The dirty laundry fairy is something Cole's trying to make up into my story. No, I love the dirty laundry fairy. Alright, Cole, tell him about the dirty laundry fairy. Okay. Yeah, this whole time, so, the dirty laundry fairy was, uh, was cleaning all the dirty laundry for us because she lives back there under the sea. You can't see her, she's invisible. Um, she also doesn't exist, but she is there. Trust me. She doesn't exist, but she's there. Tyler thinks the dirty laundry hit. Tyler thinks the dirty laundry fairy is hot too. She's invisible. Exactly. Cole, that's, sometimes that's what I look for, though. Sometimes Cole says things and uh, they don't make any sense. Um, also, what is the, the, what is the dirty the laundry thing? she does not exist, but she's there. Did you see that walrus out there? Cole, there's no walrus. Cole, also, Cole here. Cole has a PhD in Scienceology, the study of science. I know. He's been studying science and everything that um, pertains to science since he was a wee lad in second grade. And when I say second grade, I mean his second year of life. He was very accelerated in learning. I tried. Uh, when he came out of the womb, he was reciting Abraham Lincoln's famous speech. You know, four score and eight seconds ago. Um, that, that one. Yeah. So Cole here, very smart man. He can see the snow outside. He can see the walrus. He's the only one who knows what the dirty laundry fairy looks like. Um, so yeah, he's been no help this whole time. He's just sitting here knowing all these things and not helping with the bus. Uh, but we love him. He's great. He's funny. He's, he doesn't know anything, but he knows everything. And now, you know? and now, as my career, after winning eight straight NBA titles, I um, decided to start a um, orphanage. <laughs> and there's like 20 of them, and it's so great. And I'm like, I'm a brain surgeon too, and I found the cure for cancer. Oh yeah, he, he did find the cure for cancer. Uh, we didn't pay him to do that. He accidentally did that. He was, uh, we were playing the Sanders game, and he popped 
punch someone's sandwich together when they had it shielded. And the ingredient that they had set on top actually combined with the bread and the mayonnaise and made the cucumber cake. I know, it's um, so great. I can't tell you what that extra ingredient is. Because then you would know the cure for cancer, and uh, if you're like back in time, that's gonna screw up the whole space-time continuum. If you're watching this eight years ago, so I'm just not gonna say it out loud. I can't go anywhere without the pop broth to like swarming me. I have like so many Instagram followers. Like I have way more than Selena Gomez. Like so much more. Yeah. So Cole here, not only is he a Scientologist, uh, but in in his studies, he learned. Uh, he learned uh, the scientific way to daydream. And so he actually has made himself believe that he is an NBA player. Uh, he's not. But it happens. I here. My friends have more Instagram followers With science. than Selena Gomez does. So yeah, he's forced himself to believe some things. It's pretty incredible the things he can do to his own mind. Did I say eight NBA titles? I meant 10, I'm sorry. Uh, Oh yeah, we want a hard face drop. Oh yeah. Oh, I have no idea. 